Okay, it's been a little while. I've been busy, unfortunately. I haven't been able to record gameplay videos, and Black Mats has been out for a little while now. Almost a week, right? So, there's a couple decks I wanted to build right off the bat. And since a lore, Best Friends version 1, version 1 of the deck. I do not know if it's optimal, but Black Mats and Aquaman, you knew you had to build it. Just like the day I knew this game was announced in Doomsday and Superman were leaders. I said, well, I have to make a Superman Doomsday deck, and I did. It's been a very good deck. It's actually not a meme, so it works. This, we'll have to wait and see. Actually, the I don't think the mills are really win con here. It's like a secondary one. We're using some new um, new um, cards as well so let's see how it goes oh, another one i well, more made more than that i also made a black girl uh black match which i think is probably going to be the best one but we also have a general zod and black mantle which i think is a pretty interesting fun combo and the deck seems to be doing pretty decent piracy it's just a good card favor the gods you have limited card draw in this deck i mean i could put in some card draw elements for anarchy but we'll see uh Super Strength, well, technically, this could be card draw, right? <laughs> Super Strength, Steve, the brand new guy. He's just basically replaces, what's it called? Uh, Wildcats, and he's a pretty decent card. Not bad, not bad. Uh, Partners of Crime took a treat from some card draw. This one is pretty cool if it goes off. Man, bad, just your basic anarchy early game. Uh, Mr. Freeze, Two-Face, ten, Tenth Metal. We don't really have that many gold, so... This might be a consideration to take out for something else, like a minion. Come to think of it. We only have six gold, but hey, if you could cheat it out, I guess it's okay. So we'll leave one of. Uh, Dolphin, I don't think it's a keep. She's in there because it's just love the art. And two, it's a new card. I don't know if the Thorn of Lantis is something we're going to keep as well. We'll, we'll see. It's kind of in there for Dolphin support, but I'm pretty sure there's a better card we could put in there for Might. Like steel, come to think of it. Yeah, this is definitely not the optimal. I'm just use, trying to use cards I normally don't use, guys. Like Thorn of, Lan Thorn of Atlantis isn't something I normally use. But I think people do use it. The thing is, the sea creatures have been kind of nerfed. So they're not as good as they used to be. Maybe we take this out for a minion. Hmm. I mean, I put them in there for dolphin. I think we take these out, guys. I think we take these out. Oh, and then the new... Look, it's a job for. Uh, I don't know if this is a keep for this deck, but we'll see. Mira. Oh, you gotta have Black Manta with Black Manta. Leader Captain Cole locks everything down. It's Giganta. She's really good. Um, actually, I guess we could leave the throne. Throne's kind of a good flubber to give her. Then we got Aquaman Recruit for synergy with Dolphin. Atlanta, she's pretty good. Again, synergy with... So, so I'm trying to use synergy for the sea creatures. And there's Superman. And then I'm doing Surprise. It's a card. I don't think that's bad. We're never probably going to get the Adrenaline proc. But hey, let's play it. It's just something I don't play too often. And you see it once in a while. And then usually when you do, it is a surprise. All right, let's go. Mmm, Wow. You do not see Zantana and Aquaman very often, and oh, this is a great hand except for Surprise. Wow, this is a very good good hand, and we go first, so that means we get to hit. I say we kill Aquaman, or do we go after Zantana? Zantana's actually underrated. I like her a lot. She could do a lot of nasty stuff, but I think Aquaman's probably the uh, better fit here. Too bad uh, this goes back to your hand. Because super strength would be really nice. If we need it, I mean, if they do something amazing that we can't remove, we could do some shenanigans. Uh, you can't be greedy with... Um, oh, well, that's... I wonder why... Okay. Oh, two, not one bat, but two man bat. Well, we have to kill that because otherwise it's going to be hell on earth. But let's do this. <laughs> Just to fool my opponent. They say, oh, look, this guy's going face like an idiot. Yeah, that would be a big mistake. Yeah, we got a trait. Can't leave that on board. Good thing for us that it was not protected. Otherwise, we would have to have done two-man bats. Uh, 
there's a lot of answers they could have to this, so. Like, Timothy. Uh, I don't know, maybe we should have been focusing on Xantana, but... Ooh, the good thing... Well, no, it's not the good thing. We can't get through this. That's really devastating for us. Yeah, right, right. We might have lost this, guys. Mm -hmm. Well, we could do this and mill their deck a bit. But is that a little bit greedy? I'd rather personally develop a minion to contest the board. Yeah, we can't be greedy, guys. We can't be greedy. Okay, that's a decent thing. And we kill... Do we ever go face? No. All right, so unfortunately we can't stop that. Um, we do got... We do have Black Manta online next turn, so that's good. If we have the opportunity, we might need to uh, contest the board. You cannot be greedy with his ability. As much as it would be awesome to mill decks... Ooh, okay. Well, they're gonna do some trading, I'm assuming. To make some space. Uh, I don't know if we're gonna get there because we do have super strength, but oh, that's pretty good and it's protected. Ooh, that's pretty good too. Well, he doesn't protect that, that's okay. Yeah, like here we cannot be greedy. Oh, we don't have any good Oh man, we, we we have to hit into this. Uh, we need card draw, so let's do that. Yeah, we ah, unfortunately we, we we just don't have the luxury. We have to do that. Oh, because we're way behind on board. I don't know if this deck's viable, but it, it's definitely fun. We'll do a couple games, see how it goes. I think the Zod version's a little bit better. Ooh, greedy, 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 greedy. They were kind of hoping going for um, Aquaman. They might just go face and let me do or yeah maybe we should have focused on zantana because now we're kind of in bad spot yeah this is gg there's no way we get back in this okay let's go next one hmm. now this is a combo you don't see too often anymore is uh cyclops well we need a better mulligan and there is an argument to keep that against shazam but we need early game we kind of got it. All right, well, this will probably go off. And they're probably going to go after Homeboy. Let's see what we get. If we get a good mill. Get a good transformation. Uh, well, Energy has our easy way. Liberty Bell uh, to get in there. Ambush Bug can't contest it. But Liberty Bell definitely can if they're running it. Well, that's not Liberty Bell. Interesting, okay. Alright, so let's see what happens here. Alright, alright. I'll take it. Well, we will definitely do that. We don't really worry about too much. Let's. We, we, we need to develop here. I think we take out Shazam. Do we ever buff this up to prevent it from like a, what's it called? Um, ambush bug. Yes, we do. Just in case. It protects it from ambush bugs, so that's good. We can lock down Shazam next turn. Uh, we cannot prevent them from putting those beautiful, um, actually, the lightning bolts are actually a very good counter to uh, a mill deck, so. There is that. And there's Ambush Bug just right on cue. All right. Uh, well, we're not going to be able to kill Shazam. I don't know. We're not having an explosive turns, guys. We're definitely doing this to see what we get. Oh, Whale's pretty decent. He's pretty decent. But I kind of want to lock down Mr. Shazam. Do we ever contest here to protect? We kind of have to start pushing pressure, guys. Mmm. Mmm. 
We kind of get punished here from another ambush bug, though, but what can you do? This is going to go off pretty quick, too. I don't think we beat this deck. Well, it doesn't matter if we went face or not. Well, actually, yeah, it would have because it would have had two more extra health. No matter what, they, they would answer for it. Oh, and at the end of the video, we're going to have definitely a uh, video on the new card. We got a comic preview. So now we could get some shenanigans going. So first things first, let's develop this. Okay. Wow. See, so that goes here. This goes here. Nice. Robin's always good to see mailed. This is going to be very much an issue. Uh, we don't... Oh, well, I guess we do this. And then we do this. I guess the th the Lantis isn't so bad. Uh, I mean, it just dies, but there's not much I can do about it. Shazam goes off, but Shazam, you know, I mean, they're, they're not that much health. Uh, this is going to be really good next turn. I think we're on our gold turn, right? Yeah, the first game is just, yeah. What can you do? Oh, whoa, that's actually pretty good. Hmm. Wow, okay, so they can clear everything except for that. Now, I'm assuming they're going to hit into this. If they're smart, yep, they are. My opponent's actually pretty smart. Uh, they're going to probably save that. There's no reason to do six... Nothing. Ooh, wow. Uh, I don't think we really care about Mr. Soups just now. Let's get some uh, stuff going. Uh, they don't have enough of their ability. They have two off, so if they could do two card draw, well, one card draw now. Oh no, two more, and they could kill this. Hopefully, we get some value. Mm, that's pretty good. So they're gonna they're gonna be able to kill. Yeah, this is a tough matchup. But the good thing is they're using a lot of their resources to to clear our board. Superman's going to go pretty much uncontested. Uh, are we ever going to get through there, though? That's the issue. Uh, we have to do this. I mean, I don't think Dolphin's a keeper, guy. She's just because she's a new card. All right, so let's see. Shazam's out, but Shazam can't really do much um hopefully we get some nice uh turns going because we're kind of behind yeah dolphin has to go i mean dolphin would have been awesome if they didn't clear my board last turn right actually yeah that would have been a situation where dolphin would have been amazing but uh, shazam's almost dead now the problem is those lightning bolts really mess up the mill all right but hey you can't have your everything okay so what they're gonna do is they're gonna have the recruit go in there kill that take away the shield i'm assuming because uh yeah well or they could sacrifice shazam which they might be considering right now because i mean shazam's pretty much done oh or that's pretty nice Jeez, you don't ever see these effing cards by the way Okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. And this opponent of mine has literally kept me off the board this whole game. I have not had any tempo. I mean, I've been barely struggling to keep something going. And it's just it's amazing how my opponent's just able to... Uh... Yeah, I mean, then there's this bullshit too. Well, the good thing is we do get to kill the piece of garbage, Shazam. <laughs> so effing stupid. Like I said, you can't be greedy about this, the, the, uh, yeah, it's just, it's just such bullshit. I'm ah, sorry, but that whole, it, it's like, it is amazing. I don't know people say that it needs to be nerfed. I'm not, I'm just getting a little salty. But when I play Shazam, guys, I never get my lightning bolts. But when I go against an opponent like this, where it's always when I record, by the way. They always get 
They're lightning bolts. It's ridiculous. Well, the aura is going to protect Homeboy for the first blast, but we'll see what happens after that. Is this a complete and utter board clear? It could be, except for the 11 4. So I do get to keep. I do, I do get to kill Booster, but. Are they going to get more? Are they going to get more? Well, no. Oh, let's do this. I need a gold. Oh, Shazam, let's go. All right, so Shazam's actually really, really good. Let's look at what we're going to do here. Wow, I don't think you should have left, but... Hey, I'll take a win. That was a grindy game. Sorry, I got a little salty, guys, but I do understand the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the f feel bad elements of lightning bolts. Uh, I never get them. Just like you saw here today, I never get the F and seahorse either, right? So it's like, Everyone complains about the seahorse. Everyone complains about the lightning, but it's perspective. Like when I play against people, they always get lucky. When I play the car, the the decks with these leaders and whatnot, yeah, I never ever get lucky. Anyways, I apologize again. All right, guys, we got the. Uh, looks like it's gonna be a weekly thing, a comic preview for tomorrow. We will, of course, have the video for it. Like always, comic preview, Batman Noel. So it's Tis the Season. This week's comic adventure is Batman Noel. Uh, a Halloween-themed comic, which is awesome, uh, which will be released tomorrow. In the meantime, here is our comic preview. Batman patrols the streets of Gotham during the holiday. What trouble will he find along the way? Will you be tactical or direct? I love this makeshift barricade. It's a bronze. I love the art, by the way. 4-3 guard can't attack. Well, that's kind of cool. Um, at the start of the game, draw an extra card and charge Batman. OP, OP, smash the barricade, take an indirect force. I, like I told you, the rogue elements of this, roguelike elements in the game, uh, in the comics are a lot of fun. Which guys will you take into battle? Which strategy should Batman employ against the thief? Uh, Integra Gate. It's uh, free. Deal one damage to an enemy recruit. Create purse. Pursue the lead three. Oh, pursue the lead three cards in the top of your deck. All right, so we don't know what those are. Sue, so I'm assuming it's called. Uh, we'll have to find out. Uh, or we could do the tracking device, which is a gadget. Charge Batman. That's also free. When. Tr uh, then track a random recruit in the top five cards of your of your opponent's deck. When they are drawn, create a tracking device in your hand. Interesting. Okay. Who will you visit? Who who do Superman and and, and uh, Batman visit? I love the art, by the way. Awesome. A mother reading her daughter a bedtime story. A couple take uh, talking in the park. A child giving her grandparents a gift. Awesome. Sometimes I think that helping people, saving people, and just and can be just as easy as showing them your face. The face of someone exactly like them. Superman. The rewards. <clears throat> bah humbug. Catwoman card back. And 1,000 dual cards. Always the dual card. But this is a famous card variant or comic variant so love that we're getting that so look at this oh great card it's low feb without the body so it's a silver bah humbug give your your opponent can't play in action next turn can't play actions plural if it was one it'd be still good but even then and of course you get draw cards so tax is getting more card draw why is this not a might card, guys. Please make it might. It would be awesome, but it's not going to happen. Yeah, a good card. Now, the thing is this, though. It is a good card no matter what. There's a couple things to it, though. You have to take into consideration. If you're playing against an aggressive deck, they're not going to really effing care, right? You, if you fall behind board, you play this, like uh, let's say on turn three, you, you only have your silver or bronze. You're not going to use a silver to prevent your opponent from not playing actions that is really good though against the matchup i just had a second ago with all those nasty um 
Lightning Bolt, so there is that. This also can help against control decks like Tyranny. You know, the calling could be delayed a turn, which could be instrumental for them to be allowing a more aggressive or mid-range uh, de uh, deck to have a turn where they could smack or something like that. So it's going to be interesting to uh, to uh, see how this comes into play. And will there be room for it? I think there will be. Tactics isn't traditionally your controlly type faction, but it is and it isn't. But uh, Batman and Ivy is actually a really good control deck right now. So this is another tool that I'm pretty sure that deck will like. I don't know if it'll be in every deck because, again, you do lose tempo by playing it, by not developing a recruit. And against certain matchups, it could be something you're just never going to have time to play it. Uh, uh, well, Doomsday's Flash aren't really a thing right now, but it, if it was, this would be a great card to come up, possibly slow them down if they were going to do the burn turn. It'll be good against like Shazam decks, stuff like that. So, yeah, I do think it's a really good card. Uh, it's definitely not going to be in every deck, kind of like the Witching Hour. Everyone was talking about how that's going to change everything. It ended up being kind of not a bust, but it's just a card that uh, is not going to be in every deck. And the problem is tactics, especially the silver slot, is very highly contested right now. So, yeah, it's going to be interesting. We'll definitely showcase the deck. We'll probably put together our own build of Batman and Ivy or some maybe Batgirl and and uh something or we'll, we'll see you know uh batgirl's definitely not good for control she she's, doesn't really have the tools mr batsy does but um i mean they ac access the same cards for the most part but her her synergies are what you have to build the deck around so yeah it's gonna be interesting to see yeah shazam players beware Bah humbug is coming for you. And that is true, Mr. Willow. That is true. So we're going to see how this card goes. It's definitely not going to be in every deck, but it's definitely good no matter what. It's Lotheb without the body. Lotheb was an amazing card. It's still pricey play in standard if it was in standard. But yeah, we'll be back tomorrow, guys. We will definitely do another... Uh, What's it called? Recording of some more Black Manta. We're 50% tonight. Uh, that first game, yeah, yeah. But, um, and I honestly thought my opponent kind of gave up a little bit too soon in the second game. But, hey, it's all good. It's all good. But next uh, Black Manta deck I want to showcase is the Zod. And then after that, we'll do probably the Batgirl. All right, guys. Late.